Hi guys, Brian the One here. Welcome back. Today I'm opening three new Jurassic World toys based off Strike Attack. So Strike Attack, Dilophosaurus, Gigantospinosaurus, and Atrociraptor. So these are all three here. Start with the Atrociraptor. Put, oh gosh, put both of these aside. All of them have the blue and beta. The area where they're located so this one's forest this one is a uh, desert and mountain for the loft source right there on the back it just shows um those information and the one that that is we are not showing is the press the sutures which we already have of course for those of you who saw that on one of my videos anyway let's open it up no more time wasted boop and boop all right, so the Atrociraptor is it? This is a different model. It's like the other Atrociraptors, except it has these feathers. I think these are feathers. I think the tail has some nice texture. The pose is different, and it's green, like the forest, of course. So it can open its mouth like all Atrociraptors. It can do this. Oh gosh, it's so this one's stiff. Okay, there we go. Got it. So there's both legs, the arms go, and can uh, rotate up, up and down. Legs can uh, go far, and can move. The action feature is simple. Press this button and it moves its head. If you open its mouth, it would be even more fiercer. Scan code, right here. Scan code's right here. Awesome. Next, start with the Dilophosaurus. I'm saving this one for last, of course, because uh, it's a new dinosaur. Dilophosaurus, a black and white Dilophosaurus. Okay, its leg is also stuck. Oh, great. The leg is stuck between this giant clipping. Oh, gosh. This is so... This is so traumatizing. Did it. Ah, that was so hard. Look at this. This big one right there. So the Dilophosaurus is black and white. With nice red eyes. Well, it's just arm and leg movements on these. Pretty much. Just like the Atrociraptor has leg and arm movements. Action. It just does this. Watch this. It's actually kind of slower. You see this? Just. You have to do this. You don't want it slow. If you do this, it would be fast. Scan code is actually a trapdoor like contraption. It's right on the top. It's right there. You don't see it there because it's right here. It's pretty awesome. Now, this is my favorite, the Gigantospinosaurus, because it's a new stegosaur, a new dinosaur. And, uh, that's one big looking herbivore here. So, it has spikes, six spike tails, spikes. Two, like, big spikes, and these spikes here. Actually, these look, are plates, not spikes. These are spikes. These are plates. And his head, of course, it looks like a stegosaurus. The legs just move. Go inwards, outwards. Same thing with these. They can move as well. Um, overall, the details of all of these are really cool. I like the texture. Look at this. Well, the feature is actually kind of unique. Just move its head and it will rotate its tail. You can make, if you do this, its tail is like just, it's like it's, it's hitting like another dinosaur, such as this Dilophosaurus. Let's see if I can get this right. Beam. Just looks like it's hitting one of these. You know why I like Strike Attack? It's one of my favorite lines because you can just, just, um, have some action here and just spit or this thing will just spike 
the skin card is right here and it's right next to this spike this plate right here is where the scan code is the size comparisons are really cool they have good size trash raptor is kind of tall but uh, it's still it's pretty good what's your favorite out of all these three i already said mine's the gigantospinosaurus what's your favorite though anyways leave a like drop comments See you next time. And of course, our goal here is to get 500 subscribers. We're getting closer to more popular. Mm. But we have a long way to go. So bye.